I'm going to do an exercise for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. I call this exercise random pulls. We're going to pull either 28 or 27 tiles, depending on if we're player one or player two, and identify the strength of the hand. One indicator to being set up for success is to have eight discards or less. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. We're going to roll the dice to see which player we are. Player one will be for odds, player two, evens. I rolled a six, so we're going to be player two. I'll get 27 tiles, and we'll analyze those tiles and see where the strength lies. Hopefully, leaving us with eight discards or fewer. All right, let's see what we have here. I like to start with identifying the multiples because typically that's where the strength is going to be for American Mahjong. Pair of reds, pair of whites, pair of threes, pair of threes, five, six, seven. Three, three, five, five, six, six, six. I'm thinking maybe we could do like numbers with sixes. Because we have all the sixes. Then we have two, three, five, two, three, four, five. So here, here are the multiples now. Let's just look at them. Three, three, five. I don't like dedicating jokers like this though. One, three, three, five. All right, let's see. I was thinking we could maybe do three, six, nine, but we have no nines. We could do, let's see, six, seven, eight, white. Six, seven, eight, white. There's no gaps there. But that's only seven tiles. If we did that, and maybe use those for another knitted hand. One, three, five, red. And then use this as joker bait. That's a little bit better because we have eight discards, well, nine, nine discards with joker bait. I think that might be good, but I think I would hold the threes for one, three, three, five, one, three, three, five, second hand down under odds. And then we could maybe use this as joker bait, but I would hold the sixes for the potential of like numbers. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think I would do the opposite. I would hold this for potential knitted and make, make the um, like number hand plan A because we have eight tiles for that versus one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one tile more here. So I think, I think this is how I would play it. So we have seven discards with options including joker bait one way or another. So I think that's a good plan here. Plan A would be like numbers with sixes. Plan B would be six, seven, eight with white dragons. We would then use the reds as joker bait. 
if we go with like numbers with sixes, we'd use this as joker bait. So we really probably have eight discards, but I'm gonna hold those here. Then down here, one, three, three, five, or one bam, three crack, red dragon. I think that's how I would do it. If you see something differently here, write random pull one and what you would do here. I think that's what I would do. Don't, you don't really need to make a decision here until you run out of these discards. So just gather, gather sixes and try to get those ones, either one bams or one cracks. We're gonna go to the next one. All right, here we go. News. Even though these aren't multiples, it's a block of tiles. Complete news. I'd leverage that. We don't have any white dragons, but we do have a lot of year tiles. One, eight, one, two, eight, two, eight, including pairs here. All we really need in here is a white dragon and a one crack, but we can use jokers for both of them. Let's see if we can make those work. That's nine tiles towards the news year hand concealed under the year category. And then down here, we've got nines. Let's start there. So I like to build around those. So we're gonna look at the rest of our tiles and gather as many as we can to support the nines. So I do see a lot of six, seven, eight, nine, six, seven, eight, nine, or three, six, nine. We do have three, six, nine here. Maybe even something knitted, three, six, nine knitted, perhaps. So I would hold the sixes and the nines, maybe even as plan B, because we do have seven, eight, nine, and here's an eight. So this decision leaves us with seven discards. So here we have seven, eight, nine consecutive run, or three, six, nine as plan B, and then news year hand. So you might think, well, what hand are you gonna play? You don't have to pick a hand until you run out of discards. You know what, I might even hold these dragons because you can, you can use some dragons with consecutive run. There, there's one one suit option, third hand down, and one knitted option, second from the bottom. So there is that potential. There's one challenge up here. We're using the eight. I wonder if we could do a nine, nine, eight pair hand. Let's just put this up here for a minute. Nine, nine, eight, nine, eight, seven, nine, eight. Maybe like that. Nine, nine, eight pair hand. Second from the bottom under singles and pairs. It's nine tiles. And then up here, Let's see. News. News with dragons. Or maybe a quint. So that's eight discards. Nine, nine, eight pair hand. News with dragons. 
or a quint. We have one joker. This, yeah, we would need this for news with dragons. I think I like that better. 998 pair hand, news with dragons, or a quint. Uh, the wind with a two and a dragon there. I think I would probably hold this two because we could do east and west with twos, maybe. So get rid of all those first. Let me know what you think about this plan. We could still switch back to news year hand and then consecutive run was seven, eight, nine. Maybe even hold the sixes in case we want to do six, seven, eight, nine. Usually I try to pick four numbers in a range around the multiple. So six, seven, eight, nine. Most of the op options under consecutive run are four numbers in a range. In mixed suits, sometimes it's two, three, four. There's only one there that spans five. Four, five, let's see, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Five, six, seven, eight, wrong nine. It would have to be this nine. Five, six dot, maybe a s five, six, seven dot, eight crack, nine bam, or eight bam, nine dot. So maybe even keep those for that consecutive run, fourth hand down, five, six, seven, eight, or eight, nine, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's, it's a bit light. I think nine, nine, eight pair hand is better, but it's always good to have maybe a plan B. This is random pull two. If you would do something differently, write that in the comment section below. We'll do this one more time. I rolled an eight, so we are player two again. Okay, so for this one, we have a pair of Souths, two, three, seven, six, nine. I think we should make a three, six, nine work, definitely. Look at this, three, six, six, nine. This hand is already set if we use the jokers. The convention would be for the second hand down under 369, Pung, Pung, Kong, Kong, ready to rock and roll there. But then what would we do up here? I would start here, pair of sevens. Pair of sevens with whatever's left. Let's see if we can pull it together. Mmm, pretty spotty. We have a five, one, and a one, two breaking up that two and then only one flower this is not even the right why this is not the right one neither are these unless we get a five crack so i don't think that's good let's see if we can maybe better use the two so if we put the five back let's say the seven is going to be joker bait if we maybe leverage the one two maybe we could play the news pair hand one two three with news that's the first pair hand i think i would pick an option though maybe even play a quint with these jokers and l build this up use the jokers for maybe south to dragon quint let's see if there's another option here with the two, 
I always like to keep the flower too. We could maybe do, well, we could do one, two, three mixed suit Kongs, but that's only five tiles. That's really, really light. Really, really light. We could maybe do a year hand news with 2018. We wouldn't need this. I would still hold it, of course. Use this as joker bait. I think this is what I would do. Okay, this is how I would play this one. 369, 3669, second hand down. Try to stay concealed so that we can use these here or here. Up here, news pair hand or a quint, depending on how we draw. This could be joker bait. Discard these first. I think that's what I would do here. Write random pull three if you see something better or different. It's amazing what you can make happen with all these tiles. You know what? I think I, think I would still hold all the three, six, nine because there are some other, there's some other potential here maybe even the pair hand, 369 pair hand. Then we could use these for the quint. That's even better. We'd have to give up the nine, but that would be joker bait and five discards. So even just those few seconds, I saw another opportunity. It's really amazing what you can do if you give it a little bit of time. Quint up here, or the news uh, year hand, and then down here three six nine pair hand, or three six six nine. So I would I would hold this at least. Ooh, that was a challenge. This game really keeps you on your toes. If you have not played yet, look for links below the video to a lesson playlist and the rules. Find a friend and learn how to play. It really is quite challenging and a lot of fun. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do, that way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next set of random pulls for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules, may all your picks be keepers.